19-year-old Abel Cedeno taking the stand today, telling his story to the judge at his murder trial. Cedeno is charged with fatally stabbing a classmate two years ago. He blames years of bullying involving his sexuality. Today, he told the court, in his own words, what happened that day. Eyewitness News reporter Tim Fleischer was there and has more live from the courthouse in the Bronx. Tim? Certainly a rare sight, this defendant taking the stand, the witness stand, in his own defense. His attorneys, though, argue that he was only defending himself. 19-year-old Abel Cedeno, surrounded by family members, entered the courtroom on perhaps the most important day of his trial. He would take the witness stand in his own defense against the manslaughter charges he faces. Cedeno was accused in the stabbing death of then 15-year-old Matthew McCree and the slashing of 16-year-old Ariane LaVoy in September of 2017 at the Urban Assembly School for Wildlife Conservation. Cedeno was first questioned by his attorney as to the events of that day. They claim Cedeno endured years of bullying about his sexual orientation. McCree's mother took exception to his testimony. Everybody that testifies so far, everybody else's statement or testimony adds up except his. Under cross-examination by prosecutor Nancy Borco, Cedeno testified that other students were throwing things at him in class. As he was leaving, he said he was approached by Matthew McCree, who punched him several times. He said, I was alone and no one was going to help me, so I took out the knife. I displayed it and brought it up. During questioning, he struggled to describe the next events. I don't remember the exact moment, he said. I don't remember when I stabbed him. There is no jury in this trial. The judge will decide Sudeño's fate.